Hey, what's going on, guys? Been a while. <clears throat> Been busy. I just doing something a little bit different today. I picked up this John Deere the other day. This old uh, 111 here. Uh, guy says it ain't been ran in hell. Couple years. So it's been a long time. Well, I got to tinkering around with it, trying to get it going. Uh, I like it, it's a small, small tractor. That's for, for sure, a tractor, lawnmower. It's funny. I don't know, I've been getting the niche for lawn mowers or lawn tractors, whatever. <clears throat> whatever your pet peeve is. Uh, I had to, look at that, just quick put the battery up because I'm tinkering with it, trying to get it running and whatnot. So I just got it yesterday. <clears throat> and I actually got it running not even 20 minutes ago. I checked out the, I got a damn, I'll fix that with some fiberglass. On all, the hood's pretty good, all in all. <clears throat> I like it, man. I think why I like it so much is it reminds me of uh, <clears throat> my dad's 4020. Just like a miniature version of it, obviously, though. Anyways, I got the tinkering with it. I was getting spark, I noticed. <clears throat> I wasn't getting no fuel. I checked out the carb. That was all right. Uh, I was here. I was blowing on a hose and shit to the tank, and I wasn't getting nothing. I got to look, and that little fitting that goes into the tank, <clears throat> well, that thing, uh, right in that fitting, that fucker was clogged up. So what did I know? When I took that fucker off, it was the whole plug for the gas tank, so it blew gas all over me, all over everything. Don't worry. For those who care about the environment, I did do a controlled burn. I didn't want to put it in the earth. I put it in the atmosphere instead. I lit it on fire to get it going. Anyways, yeah, I got it running here. I done broke these off. I let it run a little bit here and get nice and warm, and they come right out. So I'm going to put a stack on this. I want to put the old tractor stack on. I think that'd be pretty cocky. Uh, hell, like I said, I got it running. I need to do a starter cylinder wheel on it. You got to jump it like that. Obviously, I pick up battery. That's out of the old 245 over there, 245. GT 275 tank anyways let's uh see what happens here get my little tool all right here key slide the tank over here let's see if she'll go without choking right, let's choke her a bit Now let's throttle down. She should hit. See that gas everywhere. That ain't never no good, is it? That's how I roll though. Fire and gasoline. All right. Sparks. Let's get her done. Anyway, there you have it. Let's fire it up. So I gotta get that piece. I broke this, pulled the damn rubber up on it. Pulled the rubber up on it so I wasn't able to get her back in there. Wow, I just want to put that stack on there. Change oil or whatnot. See what happens, see how she does, give a little bit of loving. See, I just love this little thing. I really do. Didn't have no no deck with it, unfortunately. But uh hell it did have a brand new seat on it. Let's see what I got here. <clears throat> yeah, brand new seat on it. Well, hell, I just now see that. Got a damn tear in it. I think that's some shit. Well, was a brand new seat. That's some shit. 
Anyways, thanks for checking out the video. Yeah, I like uh, small engines. I got the old generator there. I got a new carb account for that. I figured, hell, I got one coming for China at $12, so why not? Uh, so get that puppy running, 4,000 watt. It runs decent, but it could be better. And I thought about tinkering with this old thing here sometime. Got the old brand new uh, Predator uh, 212 on it, this little mini bike. I didn't do this. Guy got it off of Diddy, hacked it, and then welded it to, to shit. And he had the whole motor on backwards. That's why he cut this. I was like, well, shit, man. Once I got hold of it, I'm like, what a dumbass. Just slide it on backwards. Spin the motor around. Hell, it'll go right up on there. Anyways, it ain't too bad. I thought about why I got that. Maybe I'll just rake it a little bit. But then I'm like, hell, why even rake it? It's a pocket rock it you know what i mean if i'm gonna rake it i might as well just cut it and weld a whole new mini chopper frame i don't know we'll see what happens anyways uh hope you enjoyed the video on the mower stay tuned i'm gonna put some love in this thing get her tuned up whatnot anyways uh thanks for watching later